Before concluding this section, we're going to talk about the difference quotient. The difference quotient plays a major role in both precalculus and calculus. The difference quotient is derived from the notion of looking at any two points on the function's graph, the first point x comma f of x, and the second point slightly to the right x plus h and f of x plus h. If we calculate the vertical change in distance, we would have f of x plus h minus f of x. And if we calculate the horizontal change in distance, we'd have x plus h minus x, or just h. And from all of this, if we look at the rate of change of the line that connects these two points, this is the difference quotient. Thus, the difference quotient is the slope of the line which connects two points on the function's graph. Of course, the requirement is only that h is not equal to zero. We could have just as easily have gone to the left instead of the right. Even so, the difference quotient remains the same. Eventually, we'll take this to the next step and look at the limits of these difference quotients. But for now, we'll focus on just the quotient themselves.